Ok, ahora vamos a repasar la siguiente página. Página 71. Ok, dice listen and match, say the hobby. Vamos entonces a escuchar. Students book. Page 71. 3. Listen and match. Say the hobby. 1. Ok. Escucha el sonido e identifica a qué hobby pertenece. En este caso ya está el ejemplo. It's F. It's basketball. ¿Cómo vamos a responder? It's F. It's basketball. She's bouncing the big ball. Now she's throwing it to her friend. Two. Two. He's throwing the small ball to his friend. Yes, she's hitting it. Oh, yes, now she's catching the ball. Entonces dice, he's throwing the small ball to his friend. Yes, she's hitting. Oh, yes, now she's catching the ball. Throw, que lanzamos un balón pequeño. ¿Qué letra será? All right. It's C. It's baseball. It's C. It's baseball. Okay. Next. Three. They're playing with a small ball. They have a big table between them. And the ball's bouncing on the table. Está muy fácil. What letter? It's V. It's V. It's ping pong. Four. They aren't playing with a ball. They're hitting a small white object. It isn't bouncing, and they aren't catching it. Okay. What letter? It's A. A. It's bad mint. Five. She's running and kicking the ball. The ball isn't bouncing and they aren't catching it. What? Six. What leather? What leather is? It's E. It's play soccer. Playing soccer too. All right, now. Six. They're running with a small ball. He's hitting it with a long stick. What? Leather? Yes, it's B. It's field hockey. Now. Read and answer. Vamos a leer y a responder estas preguntas. Now, these children are playing soccer. This sport has two names, soccer and football. On a soccer team, there are 10 players who can run and kick the ball, and one player who can kick and catch the ball. This player is the goalkeeper. Can you see the goalkeeper in this picture? Yes, yes, goalkeeper. She's wearing an orange, T-shirt and black pants. Now, the children are here playing badminton, basketball, or soccer? Yes, soccer. Two, 11 players can kick the ball, catch the ball, bounce the ball. Yes, kick the ball. Three, one player can run, hit the ball, or catch the ball. One player can run, hit the ball, or catch the ball. Yes, letter C, catch the ball. Ok, hemos, ahora vamos entonces a la página de 
workbook. Aquí, write the words. Vamos a desarrollar este crucigramas. Mira que hay down, hacia abajo, y otros acres, <coughs> que es de forma horizontal. Entonces, aquí hay un ejemplo. <coughs> Number three. Swimming. Look at. Now. Number one. Number one is play tennis o tennis. Entonces escribimos hacia abajo tenis. Tenis. Recuerda que tenis es con double N. ¿Ok? Now. Two. Badminton. Hacia abajo. Entonces hacia abajo escribimos badminton. Badminton. En cada cuadrito va una letra. ¿De acuerdo? Number four. Hacia abajo. Reading. Number four. Reading. Reading. Number five. Number five. Hacia abajo. Feel hockey. Feel hockey. Number six. Hacia abajo. Ping pong. Ping pong. Number seven. Hacia abajo. Guitar. Guitar. Now, number two. De forma horizontal. Basketball. Basketball. Six. De forma horizontal. Painting. Painting. Eight. De forma horizontal. Aquí. Piano. Piano. Nine. Fishing. Fishing. Ten. Soccer. Soccer. ¿Ok? Si no recuerdas cómo se escribe cada una de las palabras, puedes buscarlas en el vocabulario o dentro del libro también está. ¿Ok? Ahora, complete the sentences. Aquí dice, three. Number three. They're swimming. They're swimming. Recuerda los pronombres que hemos trabajado. They, she, She, he y they. They, que sería ellos están, ella está, él está. They o she is. Now, four, hacia abajo, four. She's, ¿qué? Reading, ok, reading. Y la escribes acá. Number six. She's, she's painting. Ok, la escribes hacia acá. Number six, pero hacia abajo. Ellos, they're playing ping pong. They're playing ping pong. Number nine, he's fishing. Aquí escribimos fishing. And number ten, they're, they're play soccer. Ok, hemos terminado con las páginas de repaso. Puedes repetir las veces que tú quieras. Bye, bye.